Hey there friends, it is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with some more testing of the Cardboard Glowforge Glider, this time in a gym. So my friends, let's get cracking. Hey there friends, it is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm about to go test the glider, but I just came up with an idea. If I grab this project and I just scale it, and then I move my parts, I think I can actually create a larger one. I'm gonna use hot glue. So we'll actually have a couple of fly in about the same amount of time. So there you can see it is scaled. Now I'm just gonna let go. Once again, use the trick where I grab, grab two at a time and I can drop them where they are printable. So that quickly, we were able to adjust this and make it so it's a little bit bigger, just so we can see how that affects the flight characteristics as well. And since I'm gluing it with hot glue, I think it'll be ready in just a couple minutes. Alrighty friends, so this is our first Glowforge glider. Uh, I flew it some extra times outside before it got snowy today. Uh, you can see this one met its demise. I could try and reinforce it, but instead I just ran it through the printer and glued it again, and we're ready to test it. I also use the scale option, which you'll see in the video, to real quickly hot glue another one together. So we'll be able to compare how those work. And then lastly, my friends, I have got an extra rubber band and an extra launcher just in case we have issues. Alrighty friends, so we have just added the clay. We attach it simply with that little rubber band. It's got this neat hook that I can pull back I learned the other day that I was aiming too low, so let's see what it looks like. Not bad. Let me go fly it back at you. All right, so another cool thing we've got going on here is I got my wireless lab mic, so it should have decent audio as well. Let's see if I can get it all the way back. Might have too much weight on that nose as it drops more than its glides. Let's adjust that and do another flight. Now, if this were a classroom environment, we'd be weighing the clay and finding out how accurate we are. But since it's just me in the gym recording for you guys, I can adjust, test, and get launches super quickly. Little better. Let's see what it looks like if we launch the large one now. Alrighty friends, so here we go. Flight one, aiming higher. Ha, came right back to me, which is pretty darn cool. That obviously means that I have too much uh, lift for this amount of clay. So let's add a little more clay up front. All right, additional clay added. Uh, amazingly, hot glue lasted pretty well. Uh, I was worried about it. It is much more tricky to glue together with hot glue uh, without getting burned fingers and such. So here we go, three, two, one. Ow! All right, so I pulled it back too far and it actually caught on that spot and blew the clay off it, which is kind of funny, uh, but definitely not successful. Let's fix that and try again. All right, here we go. Large glider, once again, making sure that I don't snag that edge. Three, two, one. Not bad, it's got a bit of a weird twist in it, but it actually glided pretty well. Let me bring it back at you. Because of the lift this one got, I'm going to aim it a little lower and see how much we can actually catch in the camera. Lots of twist in that light, but also this one I did not glue in the jig, so this is kind of free, free flight. <laughs> it comes back to me really well, not exactly agile. This is version two, and we'll send it back and see if we can get it to land at the camera. Not bad. Man down, no, man down. No. I'm sorry, but this is just too much fun. How do you not keep playing with this, keep designing, keep cutting? There's so many ways I can make this different. That is so fun. It's like a stump plane. Who builds this stuff?
Alrighty friends, so as you can see, these are pretty fun to build. Uh, it's a simple concept, lots of room for you to make your own custom changes. If you do make something cool, my friends, please take time to share it with us at Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. We are at HO Mod Tech. Also friends, if you take time to hit that share, I would love to see people all over the world making these awesome gliders. Friends, if you found the video useful or fun, please hit that like button. If you've got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know with this brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.